We're here today shooting portraits of the Don Schumacher Racing Drag Racers for their 2016 advertising and marketing campaigns. Don Schumacher Racing is the biggest team in drag racing. They have three top field dragsters and four funny cars, so a total of seven cars, all housed in this big shop right here. The complex here is massive. It's like two Walmarts together, but without all the creepy people inside. I started working with DSR here and there at, at the racetrack and one year they asked me if I wanted to do portraits. They were looking for a portrait photographer and I gave it a shot. Oh. <laughs> I'm friends with most of these drivers so we have a lot of fun doing the shoots. When you're doing a shoot with people that like you and they're into it, you can accomplish a lot more and have a lot more fun. Can you make his face redder? He, he yes, can you, can you Photoshop the ears, make them a little yeah, smaller, absolutely. please? We can, here, let's yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I, I hate to burst your bubble but if you look at this, I am not a model. I like posing with fans for photos. To do the, the studio shots, uh, that's just not my thing. I, I, I do feel a little bit awkward. The only thing that makes that palatable is working with you guys, you know, where there's a comfort level and a friendship. So with Mark, we can joke back and forth. We can talk about other stuff. It kind of takes your mind off the fact that you're in this big bulky fire suit trying to force a pose that may not come natural at that moment. So Mike, you're, you're in agreement that we don't really need to have them aim to the right because it's just not going to be good light? Yes. All right. Yeah, a couple of years ago, um, working with uh, lighting tech Mike Eisler, and he brought along a tethered computer setup. It worked really well in that it allowed us to instantly see detail in images that you can't necessarily see on the back of the camera. When the picture shows up on a computer, it also gets sent wirelessly to the iPad, so I can have the art director in the back looking at the images and checking things out, and then I also have the iPad set up next to where I'm shooting, so I'm able to look at the images. So it just allows everybody total control of what's coming out of the camera and to see if it's what we we both have in mind. I've been at a lot of photo shoots with a lot of different photographers. Well here, he makes value of your time, so it's always three or four photos in and out, bam, bam, next to the next pose, where it's not 20 of these or 20 of those to try to get the perfect shot. His shot's always on point, like right now. That's the one part where it's actually a job, when you have to do the standard, boring, cookie cutter type shots that every race team needs for their marketing materials. But I just kind of push through that and I know that once we finish the standard stuff that we get to go have fun and be creative. A couple years ago we debuted a smoke machine just to see what it would do and over the course of the last couple of years we added um, different colors to the smoke and it's just really changed the, the entire uh, look of the photo shoot. I love the stuff that Mark comes up with for concepts. We might be testing and it starts raining. He goes, you know what, I got an idea. Let's push the car and I can get a reflection here. Or he does these interesting deals with us holding a strobe light in the car and a smoke machine. So you get to see something that even though you've been around the sport for 30 years, you've never seen that picture before. And I love that. Sometimes they'll complain because they'll be stuck in their car for several minutes as we're blowing smoke through them. It's gonna get a little smoky. But once they see the finished product, they're just in shock and they can't believe that that was produced with the setup that we had. Ready? Yep. <laughs> you know you're going back up on that car, right? Oh yeah. <laughs> That's cool, dude. That's why we always love doing our photo shoots with, uh, with Mark Rebills and crew because they just make it so much fun, entertaining, <laughs> but yet it's short and sweet. 